Hi friends, welcome to Easy and Home Style Cooking. I am Mrs. Ragini. Today, I am going to show you another rice recipe. Dear friends, we can make N varieties of rice recipes and don't stick on to only the biryani. You can try out different kinds of pulaos also. They are also very nice and tasty. So today, I am going to show you a pulao and this pulao, we are going to make it with baby corn and mushroom. For color combination, I am using some carrots also. To make this pulao, we are not using the regular rice, I am using the basmati rice. And we are not using any masalas, very very mild. So here, the pan is getting hot. We are going to add some butter and some oil. In this, we are giving some tempering, that is the spices tempering. So here is the bay leaf and also shahi jeera, cloves, cinnamon, cardamom. If you want you can you know coarsely powder it and add it but I am using the dry spices like this. Mix it. First we are going to saute the carrots because carrot will take some time and nice lengths I cut into. Just saute this and now we are going to add the onions also. These are also sliced onions and we are not going to brown this onion salt little mix this and now we are going to add coriander finely chopped coriander leaves and finely chopped mint leaves you know sometimes we need to add the mint leaves and the coriander in the oil so that you will get that excellent flavor and you will get the shiny shiny texture you can see these are slightly cooked now we are going to add the chilli paste. If you want you can use the green chilli sliced also. But I am using the chilli paste. Mix it. Now we are going to add the baby corn. So baby corns also I have taken and I cut it into halves. So here is the baby corn. If kids love then you can add like this or otherwise you can cut it into more of thin. Saute this also. You need not cook too much because anyway we are going to cook these vegetables along with our rice. So don't worry, your vegetables will cook perfectly. After 1 minute of sorting, we are going to add the mushrooms also. Take big big mushrooms and cut it into halves. If you are cutting into thin slices, then you know we are going to make a pulao and we cannot see any of the mushrooms once our pulao is done. So always be careful, add big mushroom pieces. Saute this in this oil for 1 minute and then we are going to add the water. Friends, after sorting it for a minute, now I can, you know, feel the aroma of this mushroom which are sorted in this butter and the oil. I am getting a nice aroma. You can see these are little bit soft. Now, we are going to add the water. I have taken one and a half cup of rice. So, we are going to take two and a half cup of water. Because I soaked these rice in water for at least 30 minutes. It won't take too much of water. We need the pulao means we need little bit of that grainy grainy. We don't want mashed. So try to add correct amount of water to get an excellent pulao. Check the taste and we are going to adjust the salt. I can add salt. Once the water comes to a boil, we are going to add the rice. Dear friends, you can see here the water is boiling nicely. Now. We are going to add some lime juice, half a lime you can add and reduce the flame and now add the rice. Don't mix it too much otherwise the rice will break. See, the water is sufficient. I am going to cover this with a lid and I am going to cook this in slow flame till our rice is done. So friends, here you can see our pulao is not ready yet. You can see all the moisture has absorbed but still we have some moisture down. So we need to cook for another 3 to 4 minutes in very slow flame so that whatever the moisture is there this will be absorbed by the rice and the rice will be cooked perfectly. So I am going to cover this and very very slow flame we are going to cook for another 4 minutes. So friends after four minutes in slow 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 simmering if you are going to put it in high then it you know whatever the moisture is there it will absorb fast and your rice won't cook so in a very slow flame 
there it is our mushroom and baby corn and little bit carrot for the color is all ready see no moisture is there if you rest for some more time this will even more observe the moisture but this is all ready I'm going to just take some mushroom very little of rice you can see the rice is also grainy grainy it's not too mashed it's like our biryani and nice grainy grainy I'm going to cover this and let it sit for another two minutes and you can have it directly or any mutton curry chicken curry or even any vegetarian curry goes excellent with such type of pulavs see the carrot is also perfectly cooked mmm wow and the baby corn is also cooked perfectly always the baby corn will have the al dante taste because I cut this mushrooms into big pieces I can still see the mushrooms in this rice mm. nice crunchy crunchy mushrooms dear friends try this out this is nice and simple and yet very very tasty if you like it make it and also share it with your friends so that everybody can